child coming in from playing in the snow. But that's not what this video is about. <clears throat> I think we're up to five inches. Anyways, my Canadian friends. Friend. Actually, this video is about this right here. These little doohickeys that go over tires. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> I can't, I'm not moving my car. And because I'm not moving my car, can you see that? There's the 102 inch whip antenna. Yeah, right there. That is why I'm not going anywhere today. <clears throat> Unless I have to chain up and absolutely have to go somewhere. Now, this is not completely unheard of. This much in this amount of time is a little unusual, especially this time of year. Here in Salem, we normally and typically get our most amount of snow closer in February. But the last few years, Sometimes things change. I've also read a report recently that claims we are here in the valley, in the, on the valley floor at about 220 feet <coughs> elevation. We are on a 100-year um, snow um, accumulation, you know, where every so many years you get, you know, more snow than normal. This is it right here. Supposedly. I haven't read everything about that. I've just read like a couple things and uh, I'm not focused all that much on it. Um, unfortunately, weather used to be my life because I was a tow truck driver. But now, weather is not my life. It doesn't have to be. And so it's just one of those things just to sit back and watch it. But here, last, last thing and I'm done. Here in the valley, you cannot depend, you cannot depend on a weatherman. I don't care how long they've been doing it. I don't care how much expensive equipment, technology, you could not depend. I've been following this weather system <clears throat> for a while now. And um, yeah, they got it wrong again. All right. Hey, have a good day.